Greetings, everybody. Chaplain Bob here, uh, Light of the World Ministries, John 8, 12. Jesus said, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. Uh, just a quick update. Uh, those of you that have supported me, I really appreciate it. I mean, you know, I'm pretty much, I've had to buy my own computers, my own microphones. Uh, I'm the researcher. I'm the voice narrator, the host, sound engineer, uh, production engineer. Um, you know, you know, I'm basically a a one horse show. Some would say an ass, you know, like a donkey. But um, yeah, thank you much, because I, uh, yeah, I, uh, I had to walk off the job. Had a problem. Had a problem with a coworker. And, yeah, I had to walk off the job. Shame. I really didn't want to lose a job, but that's the way it goes sometimes. I actually filed for unemployment. But uh, I probably got a 50-50 chance of getting it. But uh, is everybody enjoying the um, Resurrection series? Is everybody enjoying the Stone Rock series? Um you know, I got time to do Bible studies now, and, uh, you know, I'm, I actually enjoy it. Uh, I've been noticing, though, that I, when I do something, I've already covered a lot of the material in previous studies. Tube says I have 1,800 studies. It used to be 2,000. Uh, they must have deleted that many. I mean, uh, there's a lot of studies that I notice are gone. And when I look at my audio files, I can find the study, but when I go to the the name of the file in my in the search on the uh, video website, they're gone. So, I know for a fact that they don't always notify me when they delete one of my uh, videos. Matter of fact, a few years back, uh, somebody watched like half of video of mine and then they wrote me and says bob why did you, why did you delete that study i wanted to hear it i'm like what and i went and checked and it was gone no notification no nothing just gone so yeah it's getting to be really bad out there so i don't know but uh, those of you that supported me, I really appreciate it. I really do. Um, but I know we're all we're all hurting. You know, we're not uh, billionaires like uh, Bloomberg. You know. So, uh, but I'm doing all right. You know, I'm not starving. Uh, so all right, I'm gonna do. Uh, three days, what, what Christ did, uh, when Christ was crucified, he spent three days and three nights in the heart of the earth. What was he doing there? Preaching unto the Old Testament saints. That's what he was doing there. Telling them he's the Messiah, believe on him, and uh, taking them with him to the kingdom where they're awaiting their resurrected bodies. I'm going to do that study. Uh, but I got to do the crucifixion and... Uh, death first, or do I? I don't know. We'll figure it out. And then I want to figure out, uh, do the Stone and Rock series. I found it really interesting that many times Israel and the, some of the saints took rocks and made a pillar or an altar with the rocks. And, uh, you know, it's just a lot of symbolism in the Bible, a lot. Maybe I'll do the uh, wine as a symbolism, too. Wine was uh, likened unto blood, and the life is in the blood. You know, in the Last Supper, what did they do? They ate the bread of life, and they drank the grape, the blood, the blood of Christ. And you know, that's where the uh, you-know-who's got the idea for the vampire thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we're drinking Christ's blood. You know, that's where they got the... Seriously, that's where they got the vampire thing. Count Vlad, V-L-A-D, 
they say he was the first vampire because he liked to impale the enemies of Christ, the hordes that invaded his land, and uh, they're still in the land today. So they're descendants anyways. Uh, but they say he was the first vampire. But no, he was a Christian. Matter of fact, in Romania, he's a hero. I did a video on him. So, yeah, it's just unbelievable. But it's getting to the point where you can't do anything anymore as far as uh, teaching of the Bible. So, all right, well, let me know what you think about the studies. Any ideas for new studies? Um, you know, sometimes I, you know, I got a video that's 10 years old and it's got 198 views. Of course, the you know who's could hide that it has 10,000 views, but don't let me know. There's no telling. Sometimes I, sometimes I feel like I'm wasting my time. I really do. So, all right. Well, all blessings, praise, glory, and honor. In Jesus' precious name, amen.